From the Tennessee Valley Weather Center, this is your afternoon weather update. Hey, good afternoon, folks. Not too much going on across the Tennessee Valley at the moment. We had some rain this morning. That's pushed east as we've headed through the, uh, the last few hours. There are a few isolated showers there. Nice sleeping weather this morning. But besides that, you know, I don't think we have much else going on at the moment. Big mass of rain off to our east. Still overcast a little bit in some spots across the Tennessee Valley. Here in Lawrenceburg, we do see some blue sky starting to peek through. But we still have those low-level clouds kind of making the day feel a little bit dreary out there. It's 79 at the moment. Wind out of the south and west about 5 to 10 miles an hour. Dew point of 72, so we still have a little bit of humidity to work with. The heat index will uh, make it feel pretty gross out there, to be honest with you. Hopping across the state line, much of the same. Overcast here in the shoals at the moment. Not too bad of a day, though, right now. 78 wind out of the west at about 3 miles an hour dew point of 73 so there's that moisture I was talking about and indeed I think there is still this chance for some isolated showers through today let me show you what I'm talking about as we head through the afternoon not particularly widespread or anything but the development is possible as we head through the next several hours because we do keep that moisture across the area at least in some capacity so you know we'll have to watch out for that don't think it's a huge threat or anything like that definitely not like the last few weekends where we've been having severe weather none of that thankfully for this weekend looks like as we head through tonight and then tomorrow we're shaping up really nicely we have a nice day to start out tomorrow 70 for the morning as we're heading into church and then as we head through the afternoon we stay pretty clear temperatures climbing up through the 90s and then only a few very isolated showers possible if that for our Sunday if you have any outdoor plans I wouldn't touch them tomorrow looks fantastic go ahead and do it Sunday looking really good as we wrap up the weekend. We might pick up some more rain chances as we head into the first half of the work week, uh, but you know, we'll get there when we get there, right? And as for tomorrow, temperatures in the lower 90s, as I was talking about, looks fantastic inside the middle of Tennessee, northwestern Alabama, much of the same, a little bit warmer there still. We'll call it 92 in the shoals there. Uh, most of us are probably going to break 90 pretty easily tomorrow there and that's kind of a sign of the times we're kind of uh, getting into this warming trend here so here's what I'm talking about temperature trend is up we're taking that staircase climb up as we head through midweek and beyond notice here lower to mid 90s starting to slow on the map as we head past Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday and beyond as well so we're definitely getting into where we are in the climatological peak of heat here in the summer in the Tennessee Valley so no surprise here to start seeing these temperatures climbing over the next several days and indeed we're not that much above average only a little bit here over the next couple weeks that's about where we should be because well like I said the climatological uh, records indicate that this is about where we start heading into the uh, maximum temperature area so no surprise there warming up through the week. So what does that come with? Let's just go ahead and take a look at the big picture, see what we have in store. A few shower chances, to be honest with you, as we head through midweek and beyond. And indeed, as we begin our work week for Monday, we'll have to keep an eye on those rain chances. Don't think they're going to be particularly heavy or anything like that. But all in all, I think the chances that we have through the week are pretty low, shaping up a nice week in its wake. So all in all, just a little hot, a little toasty, and maybe a little wet if you're unlucky. Thanks for watching this forecast update, and God bless.